when I saw the 570S high downforce kit for the first time, that rear wing really stood out. The look and finish is second to none. And with everything with McLaren power to weight is key. As a driver, the most important feature is the additional downforce it's creating. About 75 kilos at speed. First few laps straight away started to inspire my confidence. Whilst feeling much like a 570S at lower speeds, when on circuit in the medium and high speed corners, you can really feel the increased grip level. Goodwood is a really fast circuit, so having a car that's stable and confidence inspiring is really important. And that's exactly what you get from the high downforce kit. Obviously what you can see straight away is the rear wing and the enhancement that gives. But under the front of the car there's guide vanes which play a really key part in channeling the air under the car and creating low pressure at the front of the vehicle. So you get a really nice balance between the front and the rear of the car. As a driver it's going to give you a nice neutral balance front to rear when you're on circuit. And the other big noticeable difference was the car under braking at Goodwood. And to apply the brakes at 160 miles an hour plus much improved rear stability under braking, urging you to push the car a little bit deeper into the corner and find those extra few tenths. Feedback the car gives you, you just wanted to turn as many laps as possible. Huge fun to drive. Thoroughly enjoyed it. <laughs>